In this video I'm going to demonstrate diode clamper circuits and what a diode clamper circuit does is it clamps a circuit up or down from where it is so that it can be like at a different DC level. So um, this is the input sine wave signal that you see here that we're inputting into this diode clamper circuit. Um, what I'm going to demonstrate now is a positive diode clamper circuit that doesn't have DC bias. Um, I'll tell you what that means. But you can see this right here is the zero volt line. And the circuit is equally positive and equally negative during the positive and negative cycles. So it goes, um, it's equally positive above the zero point line and equally negative above uh, below the zero volt line so this is again the input signal into the diode clamper circuit now i'm going to take out the um oscilloscope probe and place it at the output and now you see the signal has been clamped up above the zero volt line so now it's fully above the zero point line zero volt line it's fully positive before if i show you again the signal was strided. Um, it was halfway. It's halfway. Uh, um, it's it goes positive and negative um, across the zero volt line. Now, when it goes to the diode clamper, sorry, there we go. You can see it's fully clamped up above the zero volt line. Um, so this circuit right here is that I built is um, this circuit. I have a capacitor here. I have a diode um, reverse bias and I have a resistor in parallel with the diode. And this again is what this produces. Um, if I, now I'm gonna switch the diode and you're gonna see how a, um, a negative clamper um, is made. All you have to do is change the polarity of the diode. I'm going to do that right now. I'm going to take out the diode. Oh, before I do that, you can see how the circuit was built. A capacitor, a diode reverse bias, and a resistor in, co in parallel with the reverse bias diode. Now I'm going to change it so that the diode is going to be forward bias I change the polarity of the diode okay so now I'm going to demonstrate the um, a negative clamper and this is the input signal going into the going into the clamper circuit it's not the output so again we're at the input we have a capacitor and then we have a forward bias diode and then we have a resistor in parallel to that diode um, and now i'm going to change the oscilloscope probe so that it's at the output and then this is what you now see so this is the signal at the input and this is the signal at the output. So you can see how it's clamped down. Before, at the input, it's halfway between the zero volt line. It's um, it goes it's positive and then it goes negative. Positive and goes negative. So um, it goes up and above the above and below the zero volt line. And now with this output, it's completely below the zero volt line. So this is a negative clamper and it clamps the signal down below the zero volt line, zero volt line before it clamped it above the zero volt line and now it clamps it below the zero volt line. So um, just quickly to show you, this is the negative clamper circuit. So we have the capacitors before and now the, we switch the polarity of the diode and then we have the same resistor in parallel. So this again is a negative clamper. As you can see on the oscilloscope, how it's below the zero volt line. So it's completely negative. So this is how a, um, a negative clamper works.
And one last thing you could do with a diode clamper circuit is, so far we've showed how to clamp it above or below the zero volt line. But if you add DC voltage in series with the diode, you can start, um, you can start the signal at any level. So if I add like uh, two volts to the signal so that um, it would clamp it down so that it starts at negative two volts. And you could do the same thing with um, the positive end. Like uh, for a clamped positive signal, you can clamp it up so that it starts at positive two volts. It doesn't have to be the zero volt line. That's if you have no DC voltage, but you can add um, DC offset so that you can start you can clamp it up to any level like if you wanted to start at positive three volts or anything like that so um, I added a link in the description below so that you can see all the um, various diode clamper circuits so that um, you can know how to build each one